No, no, don't go in there. She's about to die. No, not the baby. No, don't. I can't see this. That's it? How are you not scared? This is the most terrifying movie ever. I mean, how are you scared? It's only a movie. Yeah, but it was voted the most terrifying movie ever. It's the most terrifying thing I've ever seen. And to think it was based on a true story? <laughs> all horror movies are based on a true story. They try to make it more terrifying that way. But it's all just a marketing tool. Well, it worked. But do you want to know a real scary story? What? Our school is haunted. Now that, I don't believe. You sure about that? Legend has it, 40 years ago, the school cafeteria caught a fire. And while some were able to make it out, others didn't. And they died from the smoke. Really? Yes, really. And they buried them behind the school. But years later, they tore down our school and rebuilt it on top of the graves. Great story, Roman. You should actually think about becoming a writer. That was pretty impressive how you just made that up on the spot. <laughs> oh, I made it up? Yeah. So you don't believe me? No. Well, how about I show you? How? Let's go to the school. Boy, I am not about to go to the school with you. <sighs> you scared? No. Well then, come on. <sighs> there it is. Haunted High. Whatever, it's not even scary. Oh, so you're not scared? No. Well, I guess I can just leave you here. No, don't leave me. <clears throat> I'm not scared. Whatever, scary cat. Come on. Whoops, it's locked. Might as well go ahead and head out. Uh, hold up. It's a window out back, so I'll just be right back. No, don't be long. Huh, why? You scared? No, I just don't want to be out here by myself alone. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Just wait right here, I'll be back. It's cold. I'm serious. Stop playing. This isn't funny. Okay, I admit it, I'm scared. Calm down, it's me. I heard something. I thought you weren't scared. No, I'm not, I'm not scared. It's, I heard something, that's all. Bro, whatever, come on. All right, um, I'm about to go turn on the lights, so hold this. You about to leave me again? I mean, I have to turn on the lights and there's literally nobody here. Why are you whispering? Except the ghost. I'm not scared. Sure you are. I'm going to the restroom. All right, I'll be back. Just hurry up. What is that? Roman, this isn't funny. I don't know how you find this funny, but you made your point. If you don't stop, I'm leaving. Exactly. <laughs> Real funny. Really thought you got me. <laughs> Roman, where are you? I didn't come here to play hide and seek. Roman, I don't know what you're doing, but you need to get back. I just saw a teacher, and what if she catches us, and then they're going to call the cops, and we're going to go to jail. I want you to get back now. 
I'm ready to go. Just call me back. Oh, Mr. Jones, I'm so glad I've seen you. It's like nobody's in the school, but have you seen Roman? We were just, you know, roaming the halls, not doing anything bad. But have you seen him? Like, I haven't seen him recently. Mr. Jones? Mr. Jones. What the, what the heck? Principal Dion, everybody, we have to get out of here. It's some weird stuff happening to the janitor. It's like he's a zombie or something. We have to go. No, no, not you guys too. What's wrong? Are you okay? We gotta get out of here, Roman. This is this school is actually haunted. There were students and the teacher and the and the janitors and the students, they were all zombies. I'm being so serious, Roman. We gotta get out of here. Why are you just standing there? We gotta leave. What are you pointing at? No, no. no. I told you, Roman, we gotta leave. They got you. No. What happened to you? They got you. Wake up! What happened? Uh, what happened? You fell asleep watching a movie and you were talking in your sleep. So, it was a dream? It, it was all a dream? I'm never watching a scary movie ever again. I mean, are you okay? You know yeah. what? Uh, it's getting late. Let me just walk you home. It was weird because the zombies were like dancing or something. They were like, you know, just doing all that stuff. Bro, you're crazy.
really need to draw no code with these sandwiches, man. Hey, 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 bro. Hey, Ain't nobody trying to hit no whole album with him simply good. Like, what? Hey, Jeez. shut it up and put your phones away. Uh-uh, ain't none of that, okay? This is detention, not no social meeting group. But I forgot, y'all the cool kids, huh? Y'all going viral, catching devious licks by destroying school property and assaulting teachers. But it's cool, because y'all going to learn a lesson today. Man, whatever. Oh, whatever, huh? Mr. Mess up the dang principal breaks. How you learn how to do that anyway? I was learning to be a mechanic. Oh, <laughs> mechanic. Y'all think that's funny? No, what you need to be doing is learn how to be a hairstylist with these micro turds. And then you, gonna sit there and steal the water fountain. For what? Because I be thirsty. Because you be thirsty? And what you need to be doing is learning how to talk right. Take your hood off. And Miss Mary Kay and Ashley, why the hell did you steal Miss Johnson's lipstick and then write all over the board? Because I can. Oh, because you can? Oh, but guess what? Your mama know that it costs a thousand dollars to replace that board, and she coming with her flip flop. And why y'all all being nice to them? Y'all should be mad at them, huh? They the ones who got dang destroyed the bathrooms. Why y'all can't get no hall pass? Bro. Exactly. Oh, Bathroom oh, breaks are before class and after school. Since you want to stop up the toilet. I mean, it gives the janitor something to do. Oh, really? It's gonna give you something to do because you gonna be cleaning it up. And why you take the soap? Take your hood off. Why did you steal the bathroom soap? I ran out of soap at home. Oh, you ran out of soap at home. Yeah, bath soap, because you stink. I smell you. And then you. The soap needs to be in both of y'all mouths. Take these hoods off. Y'all gonna sit there and then spray graffiti everywhere with curse words for what? Don't blame us, blame Miss Smith. She the one who told us to be creative. Yeah, we were just trying to be artists. Not by vandalizing the school. But it's cool, y'all gonna clean it up. And then y'all miss the cool kids. Take your hoodies off mm. in my classroom. Y'all gonna sit there to go viral, slap Mr. Peterson neck by red. I mean, he is light-skinned, so he just probably got a sunburn or something. Oh, he got a sunburn and y'all think that's funny? Well, it ain't gonna be funny if he press charges and y'all go to jail. We ain't worried. No, I'm not worried. <laughs> oh, but well, y'all should be worried because y'all both all pretty. Okay? Trust me. Now, I gotta use the bathroom, but before I do, everybody take out a pen and a piece of paper. Oh my god. I, uh, do it! Um, I don't have a pencil or a piece of paper. Can I go to my locker and get it? What you think? No. Uh, ask one of them. Anyway, what y'all gonna do is write. I will not catch a lick because I know y'all don't know how to spell devious and I will not assault a teacher. Write it until your hands get tired. Hey, Mr. Cohill, how you doing? Good morning, good morning, how you doing? I'm fine, just trying to school these little knucklehead kids. Oh, we tell you what, they seem like chilling something else. And when I come back, Guess what? We're going to clean that bathroom all y'all together. We're going to scrub the goddamn walls with that graffiti off, and y'all three better come up with something nice for Mr. Peterson. And you better think of something for the goddamn mechanic. You better get to something. Call your daddy or somebody. Sorry, Mr. Cohill. Damn, damn. She said don't hit the teachers, but she ain't said nothing about the janitor. Y'all already know, we about to go viral! Oh, y'all Can y'all send somebody quick, please? Uh, Are you okay? 
Oh, I see y'all mighty quiet today. Hey, Miss Dion. Hey, Miss Johnson. Um, how is he? He didn't make it. Oh, man. I feel so sorry for Miss Cohill. Okay, well, um, can you just keep me updated? Uh, the police are supposed to come up here and do an investigation to figure out what happened, and I'll let you know. Okay. Bye. Yeah, thanks to y'all. Um, excuse me, can I go to the restroom? It literally says no bathroom breaks, but you don't care, do you? So I don't even, go ahead. Um, I saw him in the bathroom. He was in the bathroom, sweeping and everything. Stop, Sarah. What? You think this is a joke? You think this is funny? What? You trying to go viral? No. Yes, you are. Huh? You want to do TikTok? Have a seat. That's what I get for letting you break the rules. Matter of fact, everybody stop writing sentences. Do something meaningful, like your homework. Like making it up for Mr. Peterson. Um, Ms. Dion? Can I get my mouthwork out of my locker? You ain't never prepared, are you? But hey, why let me stop you? Go ahead. I've been cleaning all day. No, Miss Dion, Sarah's right. He's alive. He was right by my locker. Just stop. Again. What, y'all got y'all cameras? Huh? Y'all trying to, oh, go viral again? No. Really? No. All right. Have a seat. Sit down. It's bad enough that y'all killed the man. Killed him. But y'all ain't learned the lesson, have y'all? Hello. Um, hi, Officer Bennett. I'll, I'll be I'll be down uh, to meet you. All right. Man, are we really finna go to jail? I thought you weren't scared to go to jail. Man, shut up. Both of y'all chill out. What happened? Man, y'all know the school broke. Probably didn't even pay the light bill. Why y'all kill me? Oh. <laughs> Why y'all kill me? Why y'all kill me? Why y'all kill me? <laughs> Mr. Cohill, that was perfect. Got y'all. In 4K. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much. Y'all got caught in 4K. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's definitely a prank, and it is funny. And guess what? I'm going to go. Byron! Oh, no! oh, 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 oh. You gonna mess up our image if you do that. Yes, yes, yes. Well, the only way I'm not gonna post this video is unless there's no more catching the licks, no, no more destroying the school, no, no, no more no. doing none of that. Understand? Okay. Sit down. Write the sentences. We're gonna clean up the school. We're gonna do all that stuff, right? Right. Yes. All right. Man, this is the slowest day ever. Nobody want cookies. Exactly. I thought it was going to be packed by now. This is like a ghost town. I don't know. I think we should stay low until they pass. Maybe things will pick up soon. What's wrong with those people? Are they okay? I don't know.
know, but they don't look normal. This is creepy. Should I go for help? I don't know. Let's just go on the table. Hopefully they don't come over here. I've never seen anything like this. What could have caused it? I don't know, but I think we should stay down until they pass. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's just wait it out. Oh my God, oh my God. This is so scary. crazy out here. Listen, I don't know who it was or why, but they're following me outside, probably because I can't get any of these. Mom, Mom, those are not people. What? Oh no, she's turning. <gasps> get her, knock her out! <gasps> what do we do now? So, the zombie at the park uh -huh. dropped the shake. And the girl on the news, she also had to shake. Mom jumped the shake. <gasps> it's the green shake! We need to figure out this way to stop this grip and shake turning people into zombies. Yeah, because I cannot let this virus go on any longer. We gotta save our world. It's so strange. Oh my gosh, guys, even her tongue and eyes are both purple. Purple? I'm gonna draw you guys a blood sample. Okay. Let's see. This is so strange. How can a shake do this to people? It doesn't even make sense. Look, I'm gonna look inside and see what cells are in the grimace shake. Yeah, maybe we could find a way to reverse the effects. Guys, even her blood is purple. No way. Here. No way. Put this in here. <gasps> oh, 
Even the Grimace Shake cells have turned black. Oh no, this is bad. Some type of secret ingredient is in this shake. We have to find out what it is. Maybe it's, it's a modified chemical of something. Yeah. Girls, we are pink ladies. We can literally just make ingredients from scratch, just like we do cookies. Strawberry, you're right. Maybe we can find a way to neutralize the shake. First, we're gonna add Chemical X. And then, since the Grimace shake has blackberries and blueberries in it, we're gonna add some. And now, we're gonna make the milkshake cookies. works for mom. Yeah. <laughs> so hard. Here, let's put this in the oven. We do not have time to explain. We have to go save more people. Y'all are gonna attack me? We'll do that later. Mother. I ain't having no more kids. I hope this worked. Me too. What happened? You've been infected by the Grimace virus. The what? The Grimace virus. Grimace virus? We saved you. You saved me? Oh my God. Thank y'all so much. Oh, uh-uh. That's $25. $25? What? Dollars? You shouldn't be trying to go viral. Come on, pay up. Mm -hmm. I, I, I cash up you. Yeah, we say cash up. You better pay us too. I'll send it to you. Come on, look at those other people. And she better pay us. I'm not playing. I want my money. Girl, I am so excited for your Halloween party. But I hope you decorate. You gotta get my favorite pizza though. And what kind of games are you playing? I was thinking Monopoly, maybe Uno. Girl, slow down. First of all, this is my party, so I'm doing all the planning. Remember? Okay, dang. I'm just putting my two cents. Well, you can put your two cents back in your purse because I'm good. Besides, you literally had your party like, what, last week? And I just got off punishment for it. Can't believe somebody put a honey bun in the microwave. What's wrong with that? They had the plastic wrap on me. Oh, yeah, that's a lot wrong with that. Yeah, but who are coming? Because I need to know who coming to my house. Girl, you so extra. Anyways, I was going to invite Paige, Zaza, Gally, Carly. Did you just say Paige? Yeah, what's wrong with Paige? I don't know. It's just something about her. It's like her vibe off. But I don't know exactly what it is yet. Mm, well, I love Paige. Like, we've been friends since, like, the second grade. Girl, that don't mean nothing. If I was you, I'd keep my eye on her. <sighs> Whatever, girl. I ain't worried about that. Anyway, are you inviting RJ? Guess that means yes. Well, technically, I can't invite him over for the sleepover, but Mom did say he could come over for pizza. Okay, and that's cute. A boyfriend reveal at your party? I know that's right. <laughs> Just chill. Only the close friends are gonna know. Mmm, that's right. Keep your friends close, but your man closer. Who said that? 
I don't know. I think I heard it on Real Housewives or something. All right, girls, y'all ready for school? Yeah, I'm just ready to pass out my Halloween flyers. All right, now remember keeping it simple since somebody and their little friends almost burned my house down. It was a one time thing. Yeah, but it still smells like toasted honey buns and aluminum foil up in here. Don't smell that bad. Girl, anyway, get your stuff and come get in the car. Y'all okay? Cause the tension is thick. Oh, I'm fine, but you should ask her. She's the jealous one. Girl, ain't nobody jealous of you, okay? I can't tell by the way you've been trying to sabotage my party. Shut up, little girl. Hey, little hey, girl. hey, hey, what? look, both of y'all calm down before I cancel this sleepover and all future sleepovers to begin with. Now, whatever y'all need to hash out, hash it out, cause I don't need this energy in my house. Then give me my sage, cause y'all like crazy up in here. Look, have fun at your little party. But all I'm trying to say is, watch your back, because it's snakes out on the loose. Oh, the only snake on the loose is you. Decoration's ugly anyway. Shit, let me help her decorate. Nice. I might have to move in. Move in, Gally? You always trying to move in somebody else. You really <laughs> don't have no home training. <laughs> Where's everybody else? Oh, we just waiting on Paige and RJ. Okay. Oh, RJ, boyfriend of him? Mm, no, <laughs> he's coming over for pizza. Oh, when the pizza ready? Because Big Mama is starving. <laughs> <laughs> Girl, is on the way. But y'all can have a seat, you know. So, what's taking him so long? Girl, just be patient. He coming. <laughs> Sound real quiet to me. Can't be having too much fun. She just let me decorate. Would have had games and all. Ari, can you get the doors? Probably RJ. RJ. Still need me to do stuff for her. Oh, hey Ari. Oh, Paige. Where everybody at? Downstairs. Y'all got a bathroom? Yeah. Can I use it to fix my hair? Mm-hmm, it's right there. And do something with this hair. Maybe if I take this rose out. Paige, told her not to invite her. Weird little girl. Okay, let's try it. car, Jay. Hello? Hey, RJ. What's up? How you been? Duh, like we wasn't on the phone all last night. We was on the phone for 15 minutes and we was talking about science. Bro, you don't even want to have a bathroom. Now, what's she up in there doing? Did she just say RJ? That'd be my sister, RJ. I know, but still, what you doing? We need to get ready to go to the Halloween party. What Halloween party? You talking about my party? Yeah, how about... Yeah, how you know about it? It is my sister, RJ. I forgot to tell Maya. That's my best friend, duh. Anyways, why you coming? Because I was invited. Um, I thought it was supposed to be an all-girls party. Why'd she invite you? Paige, why are you so nosy? Baby, don't act like that. Hey man, I need to get ready for the party. I'm gonna call you back. Oh, okay, anyways. Like it weird. Anyways, let's see, I can do this, like this. I always know. It's all up in here. Maya! Maya! Maya, no way. What? Come here. Why? I got something to tell you. Why are we whispering? I got something to tell you. Come here. 
This is better be important. Yeah, yes. I already told you though. But you don't like to listen to me. What are you talking about? What? What I tell you? What? What are you talking about? About your little friend Paige? <sighs> Here you go again with Paige, Ari. Look, she's a backstabber. How? What does she do? You know what? I can show you better than I can tell you. Come no, on. no, 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 Ari. I'm tired of this. Like, I don't know what you got against Paige or whatever y'all got going on, but you need to get you some friends, okay? You, you know what? Fine. Fine. Okay. <laughs> All right, okay. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna go back to my party. I'm trying yeah. to tell you. Mm -hmm. I'm, gonna, okay. I'm gonna go back to my party now. Let's see a little party then. Okay. You trying to tell them? Get you some friends. They like yours, I don't want them. There she go. Probably now kissing the phone of her boyfriend right now. Do <laughs> that is. Yeah. Yo, RJ. What's up, R? Don't what's up, R, me. What you mean? I know you've been cheating my sister with Paige. What? What are you talking about? I heard y'all when she was on the phone in the bathroom. We were literally talking about science and a whole nother thing. What are you talking about? Science sounded more like chemistry to me. Oh my God. Okay, um, where's Maya? Maya? She downstairs. Um. Where's the bathroom? I need to use it real quick. Whatever, it's just down the hall, all the way down. Hey, RJ, I'm watching you. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm, all the way down. I don't know who they think they fool, cause it ain't me. Y'all little friends here. Look who's here! Hey! Hey, Mom. What's up, hey? Hey, Zaza. So, did you hear? It's a boyfriend review. Boyfriend review? Mm -hmm. It's funny how I'm the last one to know about RJ. What's up with y'all? Hey! So, what's, what's up? What y'all doing? What's up, Mr. Man? So, you staying for the festivities? Well, I'll just stand for the piece and then I'm leaving. We should play a game. Ooh, like what? Hmm, maybe truth to dare. I like the sound of that. You down, RJ? Sure, why not? Hey, ain't no kindergarten stuff. It need to be juicy. You always trying to be messy. <laughs> so, who going first? I think you should. It's your party. Okay, okay. fine, I'll go first. Okay. Is it true that you cheated on your last math test, Ms. Goody Two Shoes? Girl, that was so lame, come on. <laughs> Next. You know what? How about I go, since we airing out truth? Then go then. Okay, truth. Somebody in here is a lion snake. <gasps> Ari! I ain't know this is how y'all girls get down in sleepovers. Ari, why do you keep on trying to sabotage my party? Never, sis. I'm just playing the game so you can see the truth, remember? Paige, how about you go next? Um, uh, sure. So, is it true that RJ cheated on my sister with you? Ooh, Ari. I'm just saying. It's getting messy up here. RJ, is this true? Maya, I don't know what she's talking about. Oh, yes, you do. I seen y'all holding hands and kissing each other when you was walking her to class at school. Ooh, th this is the best Halloween party I've ever been to. This is getting messy. I'm about to go on live. Paige, so is it true? You been sneaking behind my back? First of all, I did not know that was your man. It ain't my fault you just not doing your boyfriend reveal. Oh, stop trying to make it sound like something that is not. So now you have amnesia? Like you was not just on my phone all last night? And you want me to class holding my hand? <gasps> so that's why you didn't text me back last night? <laughs> I told you. See, one thing I can't stand is a sneaky person, but a sneaky friend and a boyfriend is where I draw the line. You gotta keep a better grip on your boyfriend, sis. Paige, really? You have been my friend since the second grade. Okay. 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 What's up? What you wanna do? What you wanna do? What you wanna do? What you wanna do? Ooh. Oh, what? That's oh. what I'm talking about. Now you hold her. Now you hold her. You hold her. You hold her. You hold her. Sorry about what happened earlier. Um, yeah. 
No, it's okay. I'm sorry for not believing you about Paige. You were definitely right. Yeah, I was. But I'm still sorry about the way you had to find out. Okay, listen, from now on, we're gonna make a pact, okay? Okay. So if anything like this ever happens again, I'm gonna always give you the benefit of the doubt. But yeah, I was right about Paige. You definitely should've listened to me. <laughs> definitely. I don't know why I didn't believe you at first. Yeah, but Paige is weird for that. But you, you did your thing though. I didn't think you had any. <laughs> you, like, mm -mm. <laughs> you got that from me. Or mama. Mm, mama. Me. Okay, you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but did RJ already give you the Beyonce tickets? He did. How many? Two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. You need to learn these songs. Right. What I'm aware. I don't know. <laughs> I heard Linusco ask you out. Of course he is. He might, but he is definitely gonna ask me out. Here, you want this? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Do you want the pizza? Uh, no, I'm on a diet. I'm gonna eat this. You should've known. Hey, Strawberry. Hey, girl, hey. I like your outfit. Thank you. Did you watch the latest Kaniga Dion video? Uh, of course I did. Did you? I should have. It was so good. Okay. I'm so glad we're best friends. Me too. Macy. Macy. Mm. What are you looking at? Oh, nothing. So, where do you want to sit? Where else are you going to sit? Where the loser sit? Man, watch out. I hate him. Seriously, I told my mom not to give me a Gucci purse that I wanted the Chanel purse, cause... I like Chanel, I like the bag. Give me money, give me, give me money. Hey, Strawberry, I gotta ask you something. Okay, then just ask. I don't want everybody to hear it. Okay, then whisper. You're funny. Is that a yes or a no? Yes. Okay. Just look at her. She always get what she wants. She's so pretty, and everybody just adores her. You know what? Why was the math book so sad? Hmm? Because it was too many problems. Come on, that was a good one. It's just not fair. Sure, her mom drives a fancy car, she just looks so pretty, and everybody just flocks up to her. Well, you know, I think you're pretty and unique, and there's no one else like you. Be for real. You're just saying that because you're my friend. No, I really think so. And the right guy would love you for who you are. I heard Lenny's is gonna ask her out. I wish just once he would look my way. Oh, maybe you're looking in the wrong direction. Okay, now imagine me walking down the runway like one of them supermodels going. Trust me, they've got nothing on you. Macy, Christian, come in. We've been waiting for you. Here, children, may see. Come in, come in, come in, come in, come in. Welcome in, children. Come here, may see. Christian. Did you just hear that? Yeah, and I ignored it on purpose. You know what? They just caught our names, so we should go in. No, let's just go home. Come on, scary cat. Are those tombstones? Did somebody die here? It's Halloween time. Those are probably just decorations. They look real to me. Man, yeah, stop freaking out. Look, we should just not go in there. Listen, if it makes it easier for you, I'll go in, and if I'm not back in three minutes, call the police. Three minutes, no more. Promise me. Promise. Okay, I'm sitting my time right now. Okay. Anybody even here? Hello? Hello? I don't think there's anybody here. Hello? Macy? Hello? Anybody home? Come in, child. 
So glum, young one. Hmm? What are you talking about? I'm fine. Who are you? You aren't fine. I see it all over your face. You look so sad. Is it that obvious? I mean, I'm not popular. I'm not pretty. I'm not like strawberry. Strawberry? Oh, wow. So popular, so adored, so loved. The popular girl always gets the popular guy. Yeah, I know. I wish that could be me. Linus will never notice me because that's who I am and I can't change who I am. But what if you could change? I would in a heartbeat. Well, I've got just the thing for you, a potion. That will get all your heart's desires. Really? But be warned, child. Desires can be deceiving. What we ask for may never be what we seek. Well, I'll take my chances. Am I pretty yet? 256, 257. Where have you been? You scared me. And what are you doing? Do I look different? Have I changed? No, you look the same. The same? Yes, and who is that anyway? Just some line old lady, let's go. Is that Chanel? I love Chanel. No, actually. Wait, since you're new here, you should sit with us in the popular section. And I like your sense of style. You should come with us to the mall. See you there? Yeah, I'd love to. Okay. Hey, have we met before? You look familiar. Of course we've well, met. Well, you definitely caught my eye now. Macy, what did he want? Can you believe it? He just asked me out. Oh, that's that's nice. Well, they're having your favorite lunch, Sloppy Joe's. Are you excited? Totally. I can't wait. I didn't eat breakfast. So I'll see you there? Actually, Strawberry and Blanche asked me to sit with them, so. Oh, well, that's cool, I guess. Um, Maybe we can hang out after school? Actually, they asked me to go to the mall with them after school, so maybe another time. Oh, sure, another time. Ugh, Sloppy Joe's, they having that for lunch. I'm gonna just skip, I'm gonna just get an apple. I gotta keep this figure. Definitely, cause I gotta keep this figure. Hey girls, guess what they're having for lunch today? Sloppy Joe's. Ew, Ew we yeah. know. That's disgusting, I'm gonna just skip lunch and eat an apple, cause I gotta keep this figure. Yeah, definitely just the apple. Oh, they got the bell. Now that I think about it, that's probably not real Chanel. Yeah, she probably just trying to be popular like us. Could never happen. Get my glasses. Get them! Christian? Get my glasses. Get them! Get my glasses. Get them! Get, get, get my glasses. If you want them back, get them! Get my glasses. I'm trying to help you get them. Why are you dancing? Get my glasses. This is a serious. Get my glasses. You. Hey, leave him alone. Stop it. Why do you care? He's a. Uh, Classmate. Uh, okay, just remember, we don't hang out with losers like this. Let me walk you to class.
He didn't wait for me. I wanted to tell him I was sorry and that I made a big mistake. I don't want to be popular. Good, you're expecting me. Reverse this fail, I don't want to be popular anymore. Why? Isn't this what you wanted? To have it all? To be popular? It's not what I thought it was like. It's all fake. The popularity, the attention, it's not real. Of course it isn't. Do you know the real story behind Miss Strawberry? What do you mean? You saw the glimmer, but not the darkness beneath. Sure, Strawberry might be rich, pretty, and popular, but inside, she's alone. Her friends? <laughs> I bet her mom still As fickle as the wind. And she probably they gossip can't behind her back. Right, I bet her whole wardrobe is stolen. Everybody know her family ain't rich like that. And Lennox probably don't even like her. He sure don't. And that automobile you so admire? A present from her absent mother who leaves her alone. Hey, Strawberry. Where's Mom? I thought she was picking me up today. She had to work late. I'm so sorry. I know it's your birthday and all, but at least you get to turn up with your nanny. Idea. I just want to be happy. Happiness cannot be conjured, child. Happiness is from within. Uh-uh, 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 Morgana. Now you ought to be a goddamn shame of yourself with all them dramatics. That's what this polar girl, she done learned her lesson. Now, baby, listen. There is an antidote to the potion that will reverse it all, okay? All you gotta do is just drink this. Now, maybe some side effects, so you can't see us, you know, but, um, here, drink that dawn, and you will go back to how you was. Now, go on, get up out of here. Go on now. Go home. Now you know, you know. No, 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 you know. You've been doing this since 1932, back in hocus pocus times. First of all, why is you sitting there trying to god dang on scale little baby making her cry? Because these girls don't know. You want them to end up like us, trapped. No, 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 see what it is is. You, no, yes I do, yes I do know, yes I know. See you was the popular one in school, uh-huh. You got some against. Uh, 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 yeah, 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 you so got some against. So that's what it's about. Because you got some against, you have some against. The, the, the unpopular one. That's fine. Yeah, because I went popular. Mm. This, this is about you said it, not me. <gasps> and I'm telling and mama, you because for years, like wake her up. Mom. You knew I liked James. You know what? You knew I liked him. James never liked you. But you knew I liked him. You know what? What you want? What you want to do then? Huh? I'll burn what this entire house burn down. It. You're lucky our flesh don't burn. burn. I'm saving these kids one joke at a time, okay? Don't you touch my cockroaches, okay? Yeah, yeah. Don't touch them. Yeah. Rolling up out of here. I'm out. I don't care. I never needed her anyways. You know what? You need the potion. Maybe I'll drink the potion. What was that for? For liking me for who I truly am. Oh, okay. Dee Dee, you heard about your boy O? He going down for attempted murder. Nah, I don't know nothing about that. But what I do know, I'm finna take this shot to the movie this weekend. What shot are you finna take to the movies? You and my Ben, don't do that. Hey man, where everybody at? Y'all think we here early? Nah, we definitely not here early. You know, we never early. Mm -hmm. See, what time it is? 8.30. All right, man, let me go see. All right. Ain't nobody here, like, nobody. For real? Yes. Come on, let's go. What? Right. Did they say we ain't have school or something? 
They ain't say nothing. I don't know. Man, I can't believe I woke up at 7 o'clock this morning, put on this fresh outfit just for nobody to come, bruh. I could have saved it for the office. Might well put it back on. Ain't about to see. Man, don't do that. That's last. Yeah, you tripping, RJ. So, when you gonna get back in the studio? Mm hmm. Where y'all trying to go? It's out to you. We can go out to school. Out to school? But they did some on my woods hard, though. Yeah. <laughs> you picked your side, <laughs> man. Uh, you might well turn back around, man. School, school over. School out. out. What you mean? School out. Nobody first, here. So you're telling me I waited a whole hour outside just for first period to be over? And school over? Yep. Yep. Bro, I just walked out this door. This is weird. You mean walked in? You know what I mean. Bro, we should have these other interests. Come on. But, TD though, what's up with you and Sarah? Mm, you heard about the wrong thing. What's up with you and who else you talk to? Why y'all having that man here though? Y'all know he don't get no girls. <laughs> <laughs> I know you ain't talking. What's wrong with the light? Say, keep cutting off. No! Third time today? Better take your chain. Y'all heard that? Sam! Sam! Oh Sam. my god. Sam? Man, he dead. Bro, you can clearly see he playing a prank. How's he playing a prank? It's, it's blood right there. Exactly. You tripping, bro. Oh my God. Sam. I ain't got no serves. Me neither. Look at me, Jackson classroom. She got serves. Come on. Where's y'all going? Y'all so scary. Sam. Sam. Wake up, bro. Hey, if you don't get up, I'm gonna take your J's. Sam. All right. Oh, oh, RJ! Come on, come on. Oh my God, she don't got a landline. And my phone ain't got no service. I know what I saw, I heard something. What you mean? I heard something when it got Sam. I seen it. Man, it was dark. We couldn't see nothing. Probably just tripping. Man, I know what I saw. I don't know, man. I think we just need to chill here for a minute. I mean, we could, but what about Sam? He bleeding out there. And then Cam, he out there too. Okay, what can we do? Uh, I don't know, go look for a landline. I mean, it's one in the office and in the library. All right, man. You got your gun on you? Why would I bring my gun to school? True. I right, remember, you go to the office, I go to the library. Oh man, Sam, you probably wasn't breaking. My phone ain't got no service. TD, RJ. CD, RJ, come here. Oh, oh, phone, let's go. Line down, you seen Cam came back yet? RJ, RJ, yo, man, y'all found that phone yet? Yeah? TD, RJ. Man, I'm gonna bust one of these windows trying to get out of here. RJ, you found the phone? Man, I know you hear me. RJ, RJ. Oh. 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 Oh.
Please, please. We gotta go, come on. Cam. They got you too? Man, what's going on? 24th. We'll die. TD, you next. Man, I gotta get out of here. Don't be scared, nah. Show yourself. Be a man. Damn, hey, man. Why DJ ain't come to school today? Where you at? Show yourself. I know Maria moved the salt. What's this meal? Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. no. Oh, no, no, no. no. Ma, you trying to burn the house down? No, no. Take this and fan that fire alarm. It's not burnt. Why are you cooking so much anyways? You and I have company coming over. Who? Grandma? No, not your grandma. Then who? Your only friend is dad, and he out of town. Shut it. I do have friends. I was very popular in high school, for your information. Now, where's the salt? Salt's right there. It wasn't there before. Listen, my boss is coming over. I need you to be on your best behavior. It's a really big promotion, and I need him to know that I'm the woman for the job, okay? Ma, I'm 15. Best behavior? 
Yes, because you act like you're 10. Plus, he's bringing his daughter over, so I need you to be on your best behavior. She fine? See, that's what I'm talking about. Go upstairs and get changed. She gotta be fine. There. Now that's perfect. Boy, why are you coming in here looking like Soldier Boy mixtape? What you mean? Gotta get five for the ladies, you know? She make it clap, clap, clap. Make it clap, clap, clap your way back upstairs. This is not a music video. This is my boss and his daughter. Plus, I think they kind of bougie bougie, so. Should have said that then. They're already here. Okay. Lord, please help this dinner go good. I really need this promotion so I can get my Tesla finally and stunt and be right here with my hood rat friends. Mr. Gibbs. Call me Brandon. You looking lovely as usual. Well, thank you. Who do we have here? My name is Jari, and it's a pleasure to meet you. Your house is stupendous. Wow, stupendous. Look at you, such great vocabulary. Come on in. Well, Cece, this food looks very tasteful. I can't wait to indulge. Thanks, I put my foot in it. It really smells amazing. Thanks, Jari. Well, well, it looks like we're missing the person. Yes, um, my son will be joining us. Omarion, oh, get down here! See, Jara, I told you to make new friends. I love new friends. What's up, y'all? Boy, take those glasses off. Ain't no sun in here. Mr. Gibbs, this is my son, Omarion. Oh, How do, fella? Uh, Brandon. So, it's your Brandon. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry, I didn't see you there. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, the name is Omarion, but you can call me, not Julio. Nice to meet you, I'm Omarion, I'm not Julio. Your hands are really soft. Thank you. But I'm more of a hugger, you know, so. Get up. Oh, okay, okay, that'd be quite enough. Omarion, son, sit down. For sure, for sure, for sure. So, Brandon, thank you so much for coming. I thought it would be a phenomenal time to talk about the promotion over a hot meal. Okay, I would love that. Okay, let me grab some wine. Well, well, actually, I don't drink in front of my daughter, so we can go in the kitchen and we can have a glass and we can discuss business in there before we indulge in this beautiful feast that you've prepared. That's perfect. Right this way. Omarion, be a good host. Of course. All right, how are they going? How about we get to know each other? Yes, I want to know you inside and out. I would love that. All you have to do is hand me that knife and I can carve off the top of your skull like I'm peeling an apple. Excuse me. I hear that the human mind can still function when exposed to the outside world. Much different from cats. Poor Scuffles. <laughs> snuffles, what, what, what happened to Snuffles? Ooh, I still want my food. I'm still hungry. No, please don't leave me. What's wrong? Yeah, Marion, what's wrong? I'd hate for her to keep father waiting and miss out on a great opportunity. Marion, spit it out. What's wrong? Oh, n nothing. You, you, you can go. You sure? Yeah, you can go. So, I'm not Julio. Want to have a little fun? <laughs> as long as it don't involve knives. Not many people understand me, Marion. Do you know how lonely that can get? I just want a friend. <laughs> you know friends don't eat friends, right? Who said I was gonna eat you? I just wanna harvest your organs and sell them on Amazon. Okay. So, what's been going on in here? <laughs> Masha crazy. Forget the promotion. Her dad in on it. They're trying to eat us. What? What's going on? Omarion, oh, sit down. Mom, tell the truth. She don't need to be around no knives. She says she's gonna pin me like an apple. What? Um, maybe we should discuss this at another time. We should leave. 
No, 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 no. Everything was just getting started. Everything's fine. We we'll be all right. Are you okay, Sugar Paul? Yes, Father. I think Omarion had his moment, but I'm sure we can all find it in our hearts to forgive him for his See, outburst. she's so sweet. Sweet? Why she trying to murder me and you call her sweet? We've been watching a lot of scary movies this week, right? So that's what's got him a little shaken up. Oh, he's afraid of the dark. That explains a lot. Yeah, that's right. Right, Omarion? I need this promotion. You need to tighten up and get it right. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Now, I apologize. Sorry. I can't hear you. I said I'm sorry. For? For saying this girl's was seconds away from killing me with that knife on the table. All right, now let's sit down. Let's dive into this food that I slaved so hard over. Oh, look, dinner was so lovely. I'm strongly considering you for that promotion. Thank you, I truly appreciate it. Jari, it was a pleasure to meet you. Trust me, the pleasure is mine. And it was nice meeting you, Omarion, I'm not Julio. <laughs> Same. Oh. I'm a hugger. <laughs> Can't wait to carve you like a pumpkin. Okay. We definitely have to do this again sometime. Yeah, well, that sounds like a double date. Sounds like a plan. See you later. Do we really have to invite them over again? You think I'm gonna let that creepy child back in my house? What, you knew? Any child that used the word stupendous is creepy. So you thought I was crazy? Wait, huh? So Maya, let me ask you a question. How long have we been dating? Well, I wouldn't really call it dating per se because we haven't actually, you know, been on a date. You know what I mean, like, sing each other. I don't know, about four months, two weeks, three days. Eight hours and 14 minutes. Dang, it's pretty specific. So, do you like me? Of course I like you. What kind of question is that? Are you breaking up with me? No, 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 of course not. It was just that if you like me so much, why haven't I met your family yet? I don't know. I think I was just waiting on the right time. And what would that be? In about three years. Maya, what's wrong? It's just that my family is really hard to please and sometimes it could be a lot of pressure. So you think they won't like me? No, I just don't think you'll like them and then you'll stop liking me. Maya, how could you say that? There's nothing that can make me stop liking you. Even if my family hates you? Even if your family hates me. You promise? I promise. Cross your heart and hope to die? Cross my heart and hope to die. Okay, well, you can come over tomorrow night for dinner. Um, wear something nice and clean your nails. I gotta do all that? Yes, told you. My family is really hard to please. I try my best. This shit stop. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. Uh huh. Eight o'clock. Uh huh. Wear something nice. Hmm. Ma, you watch out! Let me call you back. Might think I done hit something, man. Please be a scrub. Please, Please be a scrub. Wake up. Lord, I done hit a little boy. Is he all right? No, he's not all right. Call 911. Call the ambulance. Man, what's their number? What's the what's police 11. number? 911. 911. 911. Hurry up. I just hit a little he's boy. He's not breathing. I'm, Lord, I'm tripping. Hey, uh, on 30, on 37. On 37 Street North. On 37 Please Street. Please wake up. Yes, sir. Omarion, Omarion, please, wake up, Omarion. somebody, help! Okay, baby girl, so what is Omarion's favorite meal? Me and dad were thinking breakfast for dinner, IHOP, um, why the tears? Um, his favorite food was spaghetti, but he's not coming. You know what? Me and your dad told you about them boys. They use you, abuse you. You know, we never really liked them in the first place, honestly. Um, to tell yes. Not like that. He he got hit by a car earlier. Oh my God, is he okay? No, he's gone. 
Sweetie, I'm so sorry. All I know, I've been down this road before. Won't be the first time, won't be the last. Gotta slow down, cause I'm moving too fast. I'm a beast on these pots. She cannot touch me. She be hating on me all the time. Um, well, something smells really good. Oh, hey. Yeah, I ain't getting dinner ready for the little chump we about to meet that's dating our daughter. About that. Speaking of the little chump, as you call it, died yesterday in a car crash. Oh, man. For real? Look, his parents didn't even want to do a funeral. They buried him today. Maya's devastated, babe. Man, I was so busy trying to be an old protective dad, I didn't even realize it. I know, but the main thing right now is to just be there for Maya. Okay, I'm here for both of y'all. Hey, guys. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. How you feeling? Not so good. I'm sorry to hear about your dead boyfriend. Dad! What? Are you kidding me right now? Do you really think that's the best thing to say? You're so insensitive. I was whipping your butt 20 years ago, and I'll do it again. Well, you just I told me. Mind. Maya! Uh, what, what'd I say? Well, who could that be now? Who is this? Good evening, young man. How can I help you? Hello, sir. It's nice to meet you. Um, Omarion. Omarion? Okay, nice to meet you. You look familiar, but I can't really put my finger on it. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought Maya might have mentioned me. Uh, I'm my boyfriend, and I'm here for dinner. Oh, man, I should have knew Maya was playing a prank on me earlier. Man, you ain't really dead. But you went all out, man. I like the outfit, the makeup, but you look good. Come on in. Food ready? Where you get your outfit from? <laughs> Toys R Us. Mm -hmm. But you like chi uh, you like chicken? Yes, sir. I love chicken. Okay, that's good. Look like you need to eat some more. Look kind of slim. I get that a lot. How long you been dating my daughter? Uh, four months. Four months? How come I ain't know about that? She's not really the type to, you know. You know what, Brandon? I think you are a daughter an apology. For what? Maya. For the insensitive remark you made earlier. All right, y'all got me. Just stop it. The cat's out the bag. What are you talking about, Brandon? I'm talking about her dead boyfriend ain't dead. Dad, seriously, this isn't funny anymore. You know what? It's been 20 years, but your time is now. Your time is coming. Mm -hmm. What are you talking about? He's standing right there looking like the Night of the Living Dead. Omarion? Oh, hey, Maya. Maya, are you kidding me? All these jokes, okay? You know, I haven't got got in a very long time. Kudos to you. Man, y'all really got me good. I really thought you was dead. The way they went off on me earlier. Who was Maya I'm just shocked at you? You do your old man like that. You know what, Maya? Your father's right. If it wasn't very close to Halloween, young lady, you'd be in for loads of trouble. Yeah, I got to send you to acting school, both of y'all. <laughs> he coming here looking like he got the dropsies. Really? Anyways, it's really good to finally have you here, Marion. Glad to be here. Maya's told us so many good things about you lately. Oh, good, I hope. Yeah, you can't dress to impress. You must really like Halloween. <laughs> really? Mom, can we be excused? Um, sure. I, I don't see why not. Go right ahead. Come on. Yeah, I think y'all going. Don't say nothing. Listen, after this dinner, I want you out of my house and I never want to see you again. Maya, let me explain. No, there's nothing to explain. I literally thought you were dead. You had me crying and everything. You literally make me sick. I'm 
not playing no pranks. I'm really dead. Oh my God. Mm. Those potatoes. Everything looks great. So where did y'all two meet at? Uh, school, you know, the typical high school meetup. Yeah, um, he helped me with my homework. He's really smart. Oh, that's really sweet, Amaria. You know, Maya has never been good at math. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was nothing. I was glad to help. So I see you really like fried chicken. Uh, yeah, I like the spiciness. Okay, yeah, I made it extra spicy just for you. Somebody find love my cooking. I don't know about this chicken, baby. I think you burnt the chicken just a little bit, okay? Mm -hmm. Uh, Amoria, tell them about building camp and sure we'll plan for things to go right. Uh, yeah, we were thinking about trying something new, like going camping. Camping? That's brave. You remember last time me and you went camping on oh, Lambo? Oh, please, don't remind me. I still remember chasing off the raccoons. And Amarion, make sure you can light a fire because someone who burnt the chicken surely can't. Hey, I'm from the city, so I, it ain't my fault I don't know how to just light no fires and all that. Country behind. Don't worry, I was in the scouts as a child, so I know the basics. See? Maybe you should have joined the Boy Scouts. Oh, you know what? That was much better than I thought, babe. Thank you. Let me take You're your welcome. plates, guys. Thank you, Omarion. It was so great to finally meet you, and I better be seeing you for Thanksgiving dinner now. I'll be there. Promise? Cross my heart, I hope to die. Perfect. Well, it was nice meeting you, Omarion. Mm -hmm. Same. Hope to see you again. I wonder what you're gonna wear for Thanksgiving. <laughs> well, it's getting late. I think you should be getting ready to go. So how are you gonna keep your promise for Thanksgiving? For a moment tonight, being with you and your family. I forgot that I wasn't alive. But I found a way. I always keep my promises. I may not be around in the way you want me to, but trust me, I'll always be here for you. I'll never forget you. Goodbye, mine. Man, I can't believe these kids really went the extra mile prank. They ain't got the news people wearing those. Man, I'm getting them girls. Let me tell y'all a thing of three. It's pronounced ka ni gra Now subscribe. <laughs> Ooh, I cracked myself up. Thanks for watching, because watching me is better than watching TV.